Hello, my name is Pixelated Twix and welcome to my channel. Welcome to another one and done. This is on Kitaria Fables. Uh, this is another cutesy game that I sometimes feature on my channel uh, just because that I've been given the opportunity to play, review a game that was given to me by the developer. I do want to say thank you to uh, Twin Hearts and P-Cube Limited for the key. Um, and I do hope that you guys enjoy what uh, is ahead. So let's look, get into this game. Oh, by the way, uh, this game was released on September 2nd of this year, and it is available on Switch, uh, I believe Steam, and I believe other consoles. If, um, I believe it may be all the consoles, including PC. So, um, and again, again, it's available on Steam right now. It's twenty percent off, so it is fifteen ninety nine. So, if you're interested in this game, uh, now is the time to pick it up. So, let's get into the game, shall we? Now, if you hear any munching in the background, I apologize. That is my dog. I gave her a snack, so she would allow me <laughs> to have a little time to sit down and play. All right, so we're going to start with a new game. Now, I did turn down the music because the music was entirely too loud for me to record over. So, um, yeah, I just wanted to let you know that's what's going on with the music. And some of the other sounds I may end up turning down later. So we'll see. And sorry about hitting the mic because I know I just did. All right, so we got a little background, nice little cutscene. It was kind of low, so I probably will try to turn that up in editing. But uh, let's get into this game. I'm excited. And how is this turn based? I don't even know how this, how the combat is in this game. Okay, we're in West Paw Field. Uh, we've been searching for hours, and we still can't find the village. I'm so tired. Are you sure that Commander Blue gave us the right directions? I'm starting to doubt it. What did we do wrong that he was sent us so far from the capital, huh? Gosh. I don't know. Is this me? Do I get to... Okay, so WASD to move around. Now, you can use a controller with this on Steam. Of course, obviously, you're going to use it if you're playing this on console. But I prefer to use keyboard and mouse when available. Unless the game is just... Works better as far as the controllers are concerned with... Um, well, a controller. All right. So, Macaroon, according to the map, the village should be close, right? By the way, wandering around unfamiliar places is quite dangerous, don't you think? We should be preparing for anything, you know, in case some monsters decide to ambush us. Of course, I'm hoping that doesn't happen. That's called foreshadow. You should equip your weapon before we move on. That is also called foreshadow. <laughs> All right, press tab. So we got, looks like some milk here, <laughs> fitting. All right, so this is our sword. Um, so do we double click or, okay. Um, okay. So beginner sword, a simple sword for, a sword perfect for beginners. Uh, attributes are attack power plus 20, okay. So, all right, so that's how we attack with left mouse button. All right, this red line. Seven minutes. What? Oh, what? What does this mean? Do we need to talk to him? All set. Good. Let's get moving. Okay. Okay. So, the red line basically was keeping me from going. Gotcha. 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 Up river fields. Huh? What's going on? Oh, here we go. Looks like we need to to save someone. Kid. Okay. Some gooeys are surrounding somebody. They aren't usually so aggressive toward people. Gosh, that poor kid. What do we do? We fight. You're right. We can never abandon someone in need. Are you ready? I'm always ready. Here we go. Hey, you over there. My acting skills. Whoa. Did your parents ever tell you to be kind to others, especially elders and kids? If you want someone to spar with, find someone who can fight back. Like us, right here. I feel like Macaroon is gonna be like a major instigator. I'm just, I don't know. I don't know what's pulling me in on that, but. Uh, what? Or, yeah, right, yeah, yeah, right. 
Okay, so we aren't that strong, but you should find that out for yourself. Here they come, get ready. So far, I love how Macaroon like totally instigated that fight and then left the field when the fight started. I love that. Phew, no sweat because you didn't do a thing, nothing. Hey, kid, are you okay? Looks like she's okay. That was awesome. I never seen anyone fight like that. Oh, that's because we've been training for years. Pretty cool, though, right? We. We, anyway, we probably should escort you home. It's getting late, right, Nyan? Oh, I'm Nyan? Okay. Thank you, kind travelers. I live not far from here. Come on, I'll show you the way. Okay. Ooh. I have not seen this game. At all. Like, I've seen, like, pictures here and there on Twitter, but I have not actually seen any gameplay, nor have I seen any um, trailers or anything like that. So, I know nothing really about this game. This is truly blind. Okay, we're in Pawville. She is going to town on that phone. Grampy! Okay, this is odd. Is that her grandpa? Oh, my precious kid. Thank goodness. Or she, is she a goat? She looks like a rabbit. Somebody help me out here. I was worried you might get into trouble. She was already in trouble, I might add. I told you not to play too far from the village, Aaron. It is still dangerous out there. I'm sorry, Grampy. There was a pretty dragonfly near the river that I wanted to catch. Then I ended up bumping into some angry monsters. I was so afraid, Grampy. I'm glad these two were here, there to help me. Thank you, brave travelers. Oh, somebody's angry. You should be more mindful of your surroundings next time. Thank you for helping my granddaughter. I hope she doesn't cause you any more trouble. Bah, where are my manners? Welcome to Paw Village. I am Oliver, the village chief. May I ask who you are? Oh, Paw Village, great. We've been looking for this place for hours. I'm Macaroon, and this is Nyanza Von Whiskers. Our commander sent us here after receiving word that nearby monsters were causing a disturbance. Ah, soldiers from the capital city. Thank goodness you're finally here. That's right, we've been having some problems with monsters outside the village. Eh, they seem more aggressively, more aggressive lately, and it's causing us nothing but trouble when gathering resources from nearby areas. Nobody here can fight, so we needed to seek help from the capital city. Don't worry, Chief. From now on, we will take care of those problems so you can live in peace. Thank you very much. I feel much safer knowing that you are here now. So it's getting late. Please feel, free, please feel free to stay the night at our house if you'd like. Why, thank you. Oh, that's okay, Chief. Actually, we're all, we already have a place to stay. Do you know the way to Uncle Payne's old place? Are you one of Payne's relatives? Oh, yes. Nyanza is his grandchild. Oh. It's a pity we couldn't visit him when he was still around. I hope he wouldn't mind us staying at his old house for a while. Ah, don't worry about it, brave soldiers. Payne Thunderbun Thunder was one of the kindest men I ever knew. I knew he would be glad. I know he would be glad to let you stay. You are a relative, after all. Please follow me. I'll show you the way to his old house. Nyanza. Do I get to customize my character? I would like to know. Doesn't look like it so far. Of course, this may be an intro. It might look shabby from the outside, but it's quite spacious and comfortable within. I hope you enjoy your stay here. 
As long as there are comfy beds, it'll be perfect. Thanks for bringing us here, Chief. You must be tired from your journey. I won't keep you any longer. Please rest. We'll see you tomorrow. Good night. Night. Let's go home, Aaron. Aaron's in trouble. Good night, Macaroon. Macaron. Macaroon, Macaron. Good night, Nyanza. We're finally here. Let's go inside and get some rest. My feet hurt. Gosh. I was about to say you don't have any feet, but but she does. Or he it. Ooh, this is actually really nice. Actually, I wanted to go back out here and see what I thought I saw. Yeah, what is this? Open. Oh, okay, so that's my inventory. Okay, so I must be able to sell stuff here. Hence this box, this is a selling box. Okay, so the ambient sounds are a little loud in my ear. I'm not sure how that's gonna translate in editing, but we'll see. So this looks like I can change my appearance here. Awesome. Okay, so I can be, ooh, gray and white, noir, calico, white, tabby, choco, or choco. Um, I don't know. I'm kind of, I'm kind of liking the white because white and blue are my favorite colors. I'm all, gray is also my favorite color, so I'm, I'm torn. I'm torn. Let's go with white because it has two of my favorite colors. So it doesn't look like I can, oh, so I can actually customize or change, at least change the appearance of my, my armor. So this might be like a little transmog system. I don't know. Okay, so that's all the details I have as far as like selection um, for my appearance. So, okay. All right, so bedtime, what is this? save point. Okay, well, let's save. All right. And let's hit the hay. Yes. <laughs> so cute. This is cute. I, it's adorable. Granted, you know, I don't play a lot of these games, but these this is truly adorable. But adorable can be deceiving in the game world. Okay, I wonder what the flashing seven o'clock means. I guess we'll figure that out later. All right, so we're back out. Um, I don't know where my friend went. Ooh, target practice. Okay. So, looks like we have some... Oh, I can build? So I have to gather these items to build these things. Okay, this is locked. Okay, so it looks like I'm rebuilding things here. And looks like I can gather, filling water. So it seems like this is a Stardew Valley-ish type game with farming aspects, rebuilding, and some combat adventure with a storyline. So we'll see. All right, um, map is tab. And at least I thought it was. Okay, that's inventory. What was map? Map is M. Okay, so looks like I have to go into the village. At least that's what I think it is. So we're going to zoom out here. Not bad size of a map. It looks like we have different biomes. I'm excited to see what those are about. Um, so I think we got to go this way. Or let's just make sure that... Okay, so this might be the way. Can we capture these bugs? Butterflies? Okay, so... Looks like there's only one way in and out of this area. I get it. So this area is kind of a um, instant area. And the blue line is like indicating that. Gotcha. What's wrong, Tim? Did something happen? Monsters! Chase! 
you've changed. <laughs> Nyanta, you've changed. Good morning, everyone. Uh, did something happen? You don't look so good. Ah, young soldiers. Good morning. I hope you are well rested. Yes. Our provisioner here seems quite troubled with something. Take a deep breath, Tim. Then tell us what happened. I I was on the way back from picking up some goods for the shop. When I reached by River Field, I, I was surprised by a group of orcs as if they were waiting for me. I was so scared, Chief. I dashed away as quickly as I could before they could get me. But I left my bag behind. It has some things for you. Mrs. Apple, Ms. Apple and Sage I'll be requested. What am I supposed to do? It is okay, Tim. At least you are not hurt. That is the most important thing right now. Young soldiers, I am sorry for the sudden request. Would you be willing to help Timmy locate his things? As I mentioned, none of us here can fight, so you are our only hope. Help me, Obi-Wan Kenobi. You're my only hope. Soldiers, you can fight? Please, friends, please help me get my bag back. All right, Chief, we'll help Timmy out. I love how Macaron speaks for me. What if I don't want to go? Besides, it's a tad strange that orcs decided to venture outside of their territory. I mean, I do have a sword, so obviously I do want to go fight the orcs. I'm sure, it, I sure hope it isn't the calamity. We need to determine the cause and report to our commander. Very well, please always, please always be on your guard. I have heard nasty things about these bleeding orcs. Tim, do you have any remaining supplies? Yes, I still have some croissant on me. Here, please take these. Eating them will replenish your health. Thank you. Sorry for the trouble, friends. Please be careful. Thank you. Please wait for our return. Okay. Quest accepted. Drop the longings. So let's open up the map and let's see where we're supposed to go. So zoom out. So these are all question marks basically because we haven't opened them up. I don't see any place on the map that indicates where these orcs are. I, oh wait, maybe this isn't here. Okay, so is there a J? Tab for menu. So this is my journal. This is quest. Okay, so yeah, that blue piece of paper on the map indicates where my quest is. This is the details. Timmy drops things in by River Field when he was chased by some monsters. Let's go find them. So directions. They know me well. After leaving Paw Village, go through Upper Field to West Paw Field and from there by River Field. Okay. So go through Upper... Okay. So how do we leave this area? It looks like this might be the only way. I don't know. Oh, what is this? Teleport. Oh, sweet. Teleportation. Okay, yes. Yeah. So it looks like the village and the house and maybe more than one area are instant. Why am I out here by myself? Was that treasure? Sweet. Two apples. Um, let's fight. Oh gosh, that's a little... Are they hostile? They're not. I'm just killing them for no reason. I kind of feel bad. So there's a lot of loading screens. Not a fan of that, but, you know, it's fine. Um, let me just check my map really quick. So here's up river field. Let's go back. Okay, so this is up river field. Ooh, another. What's with the sad face? Can we? Why are they sad? Okay, let's just go this way. Can we pick these? I may have to turn down the 
other sounds in the game because those are loud. Okay, so this is West Field. What's going on with the tears? Are they afraid of me? Oh, what is this? Oh! So I wonder if there's any other attacks. Oh, okay. So holding down the left button. Oh, hello. It's a big thing. Is this gonna attack? No, okay. Is this the way? Map? Um, okay, yes, I am here. Okay, these guys, these guys are gonna attack me. Tribal carrots. Okay. Awesome. What is this? Oh, checkpoint. Save. Wait. Okay. On to the next. Can't go through this area. What? Hold on. So I need to go down. Uh, oh. So this way. Okay. So it's kind of linear. I thought this was kind of open world, but I guess I was wrong. I did guess. Um, oh, okay. There's um, Timmy's things. Oh, no, no. oh gosh, those are ugly. They probably hurt. Oh, I can't leave the area. Look at that. Not enough stamina. Not enough stamina. So I lose stamina when I roll. Gotcha. Ooh, nice. All right. Let's head out. Plus lock. Lock target. Okay. Okay, is that meat like, do I need to cook this? Chunk of raw meat, consumable, restores health. I wonder if there's more health if I actually cook it. Okay, which way? This way, I think. This is not the way. Is it this way? No, 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 no. Okay, how about Oh, here we go. Collect. So we have Timmy's bag. We've got an apple. Can't go this way, so I need to travel back. I just found a f here. Okay, so can't go in the water. It's kind of disappointing. What is this? I can't go in there? Ah. Oh. Okay, let's grab this. All pennies. So, let me just make sure I didn't like... Okay, yeah, I can't go in there. Oh, well, that is unfortunate. Hmm. Um, is there any way... Okay, so let's just make our way back. Carrots. I 
Nighttime, so probably people are asleep. Um, and what does this mean? Can I cut this down? I don't know. How about going into people's houses? Can't do that. Um, so, how do I get? Welcome to White Rabbits. We provide only the best quality fruit and vegetable seeds. Come visit us from time to time. So you must be closed. What's this? So this is uh, like a... Well, it's inventory, obviously. So everything's closed. This nighttime makes sense. Um, I'm assuming this is where my place is. Yep. Okay. Alright, so we made it home. We got the first quest done. I didn't get to turn it in, but we'll go ahead and do that in the morning. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and stop here. I don't want to make this a really long episode, but so far it's really cute. First thoughts, um, I was hoping that this was going to be open world, and maybe I'm just spoiled by games like this, um, being that they're uh, RPG farming type games. Um, so there are a lot of loading screens, and maybe it opens up as you progress. Um, so we will see, but so far it's cute. I really like it. And I'm kind of interested in the story and what's going on, uh, with, the uh, villagers and the monsters and such. So anyways, you guys, I do thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this first look at Kataria Fables. And until next time, I have been Pixelated Twix. Ciao.